Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product every day series. Today I'm so excited to try out another product that I got from Dollar General. So I recently did a huge Dollar General makeup haul and I filmed a video of everything I got. So if you have not seen that video yet, I'll have that linked in the description down below. But today I'm trying out from LA Colors, one of my favorite brands, the Conceal It Cover and Correct Concealer. I got this in the shade Fair and it only cost $2. I think this does come in some like color correcting shades as well. Maybe like I saw green, some other colors along with some other shades. The description of it sounds like exactly what I look for in my concealers. It says it's crease resistant, opaque coverage and a creamy yet lightweight formula. It's supposed to be long wearing, full coverage, and I'm really excited to see how it really is. I really want to conceal my under eye circles, so we'll see how this does. Now let's see what the this is not what I was expecting from the packaging. I kind of was expecting a squeezy tube, but then I thought it might have a doe foot applicator, but this is different. It's a brush. So like a squeezy tube into a brush. Very interesting. I don't even think I've tried out a product in this type of packaging before. So it's easy to squeeze it up into the brush here. So let's see how it is. I'm gonna put some on my under eyes. <laughs> I'm not gonna try and do too, too much at first, but let's see. I'm just gonna take my dampened sponge and blend in my concealer like I normally would. There is some good coverage here. And I like this shade. I like to choose a lighter concealer shade to brighten my under eye circles. And I love this. I love the coverage. Like, look at the difference in my under eye circles. Like that is great coverage, brightening and so smooth like there's no dryness no cakiness it really is exactly like it claimed a lightweight concealer so now i have a lot of creases in my under eye so i'm very curious to see how the creasing is going to be but even if there is some creasing that's okay with me i mean the tarte shape tape one of my favorite concealers creases on me and so I'm used to having to set my concealer with a powder and like first impressions it is settling into my creases but it looks so good on the under eye that it's fine with me if there's some creasing because I can just set it but coverage wise texture wise it's so good like unbelievable that it's only two dollars with how amazing it looks on the under eye. I'm gonna go ahead and apply it to the other eye. Like that. And then I'm just going to, since it's light, also kind of highlight the face with it and give a little bit more coverage on my chin and on my nose here. And I'm liking this applicator and it does blend really well with the sponge. Wow, I just love what this does for my under eyes. I am very picky about how my under eyes look, how the coverage is because I hate my under eye circles and the coverage of this and the brightness of this is so good in my opinion. But then I'm also very picky about the texture. I don't want it to look dry, 
cakey textured in any way and this is looking so smooth so skin like undetectable texture which is so impressive and the fact that this is a two dollar concealer and it looks this amazing hydrating smooth on the under eyes and then there's expensive concealers that i've tried out that look dry cakey heavy on the under eyes but i feel like this two dollar concealer just nailed it and so now that i've had this on my face for a little while the creasing on my under eyes isn't getting any worse than when it first was applied so like when i make like this facial expression i can see the concealer in the creases but just with a relaxed normal looking facial expression head on you don't see the creasing it's just like since i have these deep crease lines and under my eyes it's settled deep into them but it's not even noticeable it's not bad creasing at all if i wanted to go without setting this with a powder I think that would be fine. So this concealer absolutely wowed me. I love it. I just can't see spending the high price point on concealers when I can get this for $2 and it gives me the coverage that I want with the most beautiful texture and brightness to the under eyes. I feel like I am on a roll with the amazing Dollar General makeup products that I've tried so far. And what I love about this series here where I try out all different types of makeup products is when I can find amazing, inexpensive products that give you the look of high-end makeup, that give you the look that you want from your makeup for so inexpensive and that's one of my favorite goals of this series so when i find a product that does that i'm just so happy and so excited so i highly recommend this la colors conceal it cover and correct concealer it's everything i want in a concealer and then put a two dollar price point on it like what and this is a good size concealer too and the unique packaging i think is so easy to work with so yay amazing amazing successful product definitely let me know in the comments down below your thoughts on this concealer if you have tried it out and let me know if you have any other favorite inexpensive concealers or just other dollar general makeup products that you love i would really like to hear about those in the comments down below and just to thoroughly review this i will put an update in the description down below on my wear test results it looks so smooth and amazing coverage right now minimal creasing but i will let you know how this wears as the day goes on if it starts to look cakey or dry anything like that if the creasing gets really bad I'll just let you know how this lasts throughout the day, but I'm very hopeful that I'm going to love how this looks and how this lasts. But thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day, and I will see you tomorrow in my next video.